years like conclusions that it had to be gotten rid of. And so that was all very well and good until the these recent measurements of the distances of certain supernova carried out independently by several teams of astrophysicists brought the news that uh, the universe is expanding faster than the laws of physics allow. And when they looked at how much faster, they realized that it called the cosmological constant back into existence. Well, but here there are a couple of things about this cosmological constant that are very counterintuitive. The first is uh, that it, uh, it, 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 uh, it, it acts on empty space. It, is, it does not require matter to manifest. It is a property of space. The second thing, it, uh, it's a repulsive force that is growing stronger and stronger. Forces don't grow stronger and stronger. They go
situation where the toroidal area out near the grid where stars are and they don't interact with each other and plants can form and you get the five things you need to get into the civilization. But, uh, you know, our a rule of biology and strategy and everything and religious practice as far as I'm concerned is seek the light well, the light is at the core. And so then I saw, aha, uh -huh, maybe the true seeking of the light requires biology to go into partnership with something beyond biology because the environment is so energetic. And I'm not suggesting.